Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Let's Play Banner Saga 3 here at this godstone having returned to it. Uh, last time I think we had a rather horrible battle where almost everyone got injured. But we still won it. Yeah. Yeah, this is not good. Um, I could... I'm not going to level anyone up because that might be affected by who, who's still alive. Um, I think we're close to moving on to the next day, which I think should recuperate some people a little bit. We might not have a battle, he says, until everyone's recovered anyway. So I think we can... I could rest and spend the day, but our morale's already great. It would speed up recoveries. If I rest. Mm. I'm wary of like being the fact that we're being followed. But although no, we're safe here. We're safe here. We can rest. So I think we will rest today. And then we will leave. And then hopefully that will tick over. And I think we had a couple of people who were on two days of injury. So hopefully they'll t t they'll have ticked over and they'll be safe. They'll be available to us in the next battle. There we go. Um, so I think our heroes have got a bit more. Okay. But we'll see. Those sounds aren't ominous at all, are they? Uh, does it worry anyone else that they've somehow gotten ahead of us? Asked Valgod. Well, we did rest. What once was a hill has been twisted into a thin strip of land, pulled long like spider silk, with a steep drop beneath. Warped shamble back and forth across it, but Bulwark is nowhere in sight. Um, I mean, that could be a, a, because we rested, or it could just be general. They don't need to rest, Falker realises with a shudder. Bulwark can't confront us directly, not while the Valka live. He's going to thin the herd all the way to Ridgehorn. Fane spits Ollie. It's exactly what we do, isn't it? I hate it. You consider an approach. Uh, I'm going to ask for Falker's advice, I think. If it were us, we'd lure, them lure him across, lay archers to hit him from the wings, while spears come up to fill the retreat. Something tells me the warped can't coordinate like ravens, though. But what would Bulwark do with a bunch of drunken idiots? Falker mutters things wrong. He'd make it look like a trap so we try to get fancy. My gut says we just rush it. Oh, Oli has already drawn an axe. Yeah, okay, let's push it. Nobody stops until we're across, you fuck. The ravens advance quickly, the warped is slow to respond. Slingers! shouts Falker. Nothing warped dredge, hi noting warped dredge hiding just over the ridge. Rush him! Oh, that's annoying. That's annoying. I thought that it would have just ticked over and done it. Maybe I should have rested another day. Oh, well. Well, Oli. Is there axe there? What's Valgard? Is he's he's got shield wall, hasn't he? Okay, so yeah, we'll 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 promote you and we'll use you. Da, 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 da. Uh, I think Titan straps is quite useful. Uh, we'll bring him in. Put you there, Krimler. What are you? Tempest is always good. I think we'll keep you in then. Oh, he's got points. He's got points to spend. Eight, eight points. Okay. Strength. Um, resisted strength damage, because that's what you want to be doing, I think. So we'll bring him in. I don't think we've got another one. Let's use a dredge. We've not used a dredge yet, have we? He's, he's, he's our own slinger, isn't he? So, we could use him. What about the apostate? You are a... Um... Oh, wow. Uh...
I might bring in the apostate then. Let's try. Let's let's try that. So no one's injured. I should probably level people up while I'm here. Actually, no, you're fine. Let's just max out all of his stuff. And I think I'm gonna have Titan Straps. It is the one I like. I think I like the regenerative ability effect of it. Either can promote. Uh, yeah, promote, and I'll boost, oh, that's already maxed, okay. Actually close, let's max that up a bit. Juno, 15 points, oh wow, so I've not just not been spending these, whoops. Definitely want to put that up. Yes, there we go. Although, mm, Juno doesn't need as much armor and strength because of her, um, um, the fact that she just comes back. Right. I think we're ready. We're, prob we're probably not, to be fair. That could have gone worse. Yep. Oh, wow, that's very good. Oh, I didn't realize he was going first. <laughs> Oops. We'll rest you because you can't move forward. I move other people around. I can now whack that guy, so let's do that. Yeah, they, some of them absorb damage for the willpower, don't they? What abilities have you got? Oh yeah, the disease is what I want. Um, and I don't really think there's any dredge close enough to target. I don't know if these guys count as dredge, dredge or just wedge, or just dredge or wedge, dredge or warped. Uh, what are my abilities again? You know what? Let's see batting around with him. That's not really worth it to the extra. No, to the extra break, I think. Pushes him back. Right, and they're slowly moving up. That's Gina, what do you do? Confuse doesn't seem to do anything, and then we got the will bonus. That is some, some not necessarily great, it seems. Poke him. Poke him over the shield, which is basically what the point of a shield ball is. I move up, I will then use Tempest, and I want that one. Join the shield wall. Pushing back, doing more damage. I can't get. No, I think I have to have him run through. Do as much damage as possible, take you out. Now, why would I want to go that through that? 
Uh, and I can't. Can I actually do that on anyone? I can. It won't let me though for some reason. No. Okay. Okay, it's not letting me do things. So, even though it seems to say they're in range. That's just annoying. Um, there. Um, next storm. So we'll do that. Um, and we'll go the maximum. Okay. Not really valuable, but... Yeah, okay, let's just take him out. Slowly chip away at the damage. And we'll poison him with an attack. Or I could just kill him. So we'll just kill him. Again, just try and break this arm. Think, weaken their strength as much as possible, I think. Um, I think I just kind of want to wait here. Start working on the strength. Okay, he's in trouble. Um, oh no, I don't want to move. I actually can't move. Um, again, break through the armor. you're dead. Wibble, wibble, wibble. Is he dead? Not yet. Um... So it's just these two left, and then I think we're through. I think we'll we'll stay there and chip away at this guy. And he's dead. Right. Yep. Oh, he's got shield wall as well. Okay. Okay. That's useful information that I probably should have been aware of. Is that in range? No. I don't even know what the range of rupture is. It doesn't seem to have a range. Unless that just applies to all of them. And does that count as... So that's now wounded, does that now count as... Yeah, that probably wasn't a great plan, because I'm just going to kill it anyway, aren't I? Yeah, there we go. I, will, I won't find out this time what, that, what, this, effect, what this does. Yeah, I've got a few promotions. 
but we did get an injury, I think, if memory serves. Yeah. Krumra. Yeah, I shouldn't have rushed him forward. Although, no, he got rid of a few people. So that's at least something. This time, the warp seemed even more organised than the last. Uh-oh. That could have gone all wrong, Spar says, peering over the bridge's edge of twisted rocks far below. Polka replies, yeah, we could all be dead. Come on, this isn't the place to give Bulwark another try. That was your idea, love. So... Don't come at me. We've still, we've still got good morale. Small pale orbs wink at you from deep crags in the darkness. A brief inspection reveals that they're eggs. Skulkers, whispers Ditch. Pulling one of the creatures free of its shell, stabbed through by his dagger. The stone hurler who joined you at the godstone looks upset by the dead thing. She darts between a few clusters, making scooping motions and nodding. Are you crazy? Volker frowns. There's a lot of eggs. Ollie bemoans, squinting head into the distance. Makes my fiend skin crawl. He doesn't finish the sentence. You imagine countless more eggs in every direction, just out of sight. Allow the stone hurler to do whatever she wants, seems to want to do. Well, I kind of included her. Um, yeah. She finds a cluster of palm-sized eggs and begins gathering them in her sling, nodding as if to say, this is fine. You're not sure if it's more comforting or terrifying that she's unafraid, but nobody intervenes. Soon you leave the nest behind. Ew. 